It's not my best tree, but I thought it fitted here. It's a pretty good looking tree, though. Thank you. Which, what, what is this? Uh, if I'm being honest, I can't remember. <laughs> oh! What's going on with your arm? Oh. <laughs> I didn't show you yet, did I? What you got going on there? Well, I'll show you. I found something, man. I found something. Uh, where is it? I found the fire like gauntlet. Skin? No. Oh. Look at that. So, um, do we have an animal here? Wait, let's see. I'll show you. See this. Oh, that's awesome. And we have beef. Oh, pork chops, I guess. Oh, he didn't die. Okay, there, there we go. Goes. I thought that was part of your skin. Oh, yeah. It looks a little bit, uh, doesn't it? Yeah. It blends in pretty well. I thought it might have been part of the uh, the evil geek. We don't talk about evil geek. That's another server, man. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to talk about that guy. I was already <laughs> recording. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm recording. I had a... Uh... Thought we'd do a little intro, though. <laughs> well, great <laughs> intro. I asked him to do an intro, and we get this. <laughs> no, do you think? All right. Welcome back to the Mystic Zoo SMP. We, uh, we've got a few new things going on here that we've done in between episodes. But uh, we still have the same plan for this episode. We're going to work on the roof of the ranger's hut. And then I believe we're going to be working on the entrance to the Mystic Zoo. And I believe Geek has already gone ahead and rounded up some uh, some animals for us. Hey, man. Welcome, everybody. Um, So we uh, have boars. And I know we don't like boars anymore, right? Hate them. Absolutely hate them. I know, I know. So I've collected. Ah, exactly. I've collected Fours. some. Fours. Yes. Four of them, too. And apparently you can breed them. Ooh, what do you use for that? Carrots. Ah. But I also have butterflies. If you make a glass bottle and you see a butterfly, you can capture it. So we can make like... Oh, oh watch out. <laughs> so we can make like a glass house with butterflies and stuff. Ooh. That would be cool, right? That would be. But yeah, they're in a safety pen right now, just like our other animals. Yeah, hopefully they don't get killed by a llama this time. Hopefully, yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, I think a, a glass, uh, like a glass building with butterflies in it will be awesome. Yeah, that look amazing. And I see a butterfly right there on a building that I haven't seen yet. Ooh, I see it as well. So this, not the greatest build of all time, but if we go underneath here, and I have not decorated this room at all. Oh, you yet, figured so out how to do the hay bales. Oh, yeah. I brought those in here for uh, a little bit of inside the barn decoration. But down here, we have oh. an automatic wool farm. So I didn't show this. a lot of new colors. So I didn't show this yet because I made like a wool farm. I never did that before. And it was a small one like this, right? And I yeah. asked uh, asked you to make like a big farm. And you, you did it already. Oh, there's a yeah. sheep loose. Oh, uh, he's fine. He's fine. I have a spot for him, but I don't have any new color to make him, so I haven't put him in yet. Oh. So everything ends up in here? Oh, no, no, no. Wait. No, 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 no. Uh, yeah. So this is part of what I also need to work on. The collection system is currently back here in that iron chest. Oh. It's oh, I hear zombies. Offered. Oh, no. I hear zombies. Oh, no. You didn't <laughs> light up the place. Uh-oh. Do they spawn <laughs> down here? Hopefully not. Oh, hmm. but did you see how much uh, this thing is collected already? No. Where can I see it? Underneath the hopper right there. Ah, uh, whoa. Yeah. You're amazing. All we need to do is uh, 
get the rest of the colors, which I'm not even sure what I'm missing right now, but then we can uh, have all the wool colors that we need. That's so awesome. That's going to help out a lot. Thank you, man. That's awesome. I also worked on uh, another project, which uh, actually would explain here. We can we can go. I'll show you this this gift first. It'll explain how I got that gift. A gift. Who are you? You got silk touch. I got silk touch and an anvil. That's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> Figured you'd need a way to put it on. I'm going to put it on right now. Oh my God. We got a silk. I can speak. We got a silk touch pickaxe. Oh my God. Heck yeah. Awesome. Thanks so much. I as well. <laughs> um, I also did a thing. As you can see right here. Oh yeah. And I think you Ooh, talked about it in your modded video. We got a lot ah, of copper. Yes. They got a little, a little sneak peek in that video. Maybe we can use this in our entrance of the zoo. Oh yeah, that would look good. There's one other, one other little project. Oh, how much did you do, man? I, uh, I got busy for a couple days. Oh, I've heard the noises. <laughs> so, so what I did is, I found villagers. Well, you found the village, and I took the villagers here, right? I brought them back. I had villagers in the. Uh... Wait. Wait, did you not use the two villagers that were in the boat for that? No. Oh my god, I wonder what happened to those villagers. <laughs> um. See, but... I left two villagers and two boats right here, and I thought the two villagers you had over there. <laughs> no, were these the were ones. new villagers. I took oh them god. all the way from the village. <laughs> So the other two, the two villagers I brought back must have died or something or despawned. Oh no. Do they despawn <laughs> if they were in a boat? They shouldn't have. That's why I left them right here. I thought they'd be fine. I think they died then. Yeah, probably. Well, <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Geek has brought back some villagers, which I uh, threw into a villager breeder, which produces uh, way more than we need. I currently have it turned off. Oh, look, oh my god. Yeah. And I got a little a little trading hall set up to try to get some early game emeralds. And then also, I got a Silk Touch Villager. Oh, that's how you got it. Yeah. Oh, and it's only six emeralds. That's pretty good. I know, it was so cheap. But also, if we continue down the ladder. Wait, there's a ladder? Yeah, the one we came in. Oh. You did so also, much. Also, not decorated, but functional. My jaw is just dropping right now. We have an automatic <laughs> carrot farm. You did so much. I've uh, yeah, been a bit busy. That's so and awesome. This chest down here is where it collects. Oh, look at that. I mean, we can make golden carrots if you make a gold farm. Oh, yeah. Because... The, uh, the farmer villagers will trade us them as well. Yes, because I did also did something. Ooh, what did you do? Because I needed quartz, right? Mm-hmm. And I made a little portal yes. entrance. Yes. I've, uh, I've gone through once, but I didn't do anything over there yet. <laughs> I don't know why, but yep. <laughs> <laughs> Who should we should we show off the Nether? Because it is it is very different for us now that we have these mods. So, so this should this this part's the same. <laughs> we should have new things, right? We do have new biomes in here, but um, have not have not ex. Oh, it drops the. Sh Oh, that is so that convenient. is amazing! It drops the that shroom. Is, I love that so much. Oh, I'm gonna collect some more now. Okay, I have one more thing to give you before I'm holding this knife. It looks so like I'm attacking you. A little, a little threatening. Yeah. <laughs> so I made us some bacon sandwiches. Ooh, much better than the rotten flesh I was holding. Ooh, don't eat rotten flesh, man. I'm a. Uh... Unfortunately, not currently hungry. Don't don't eat it. Keep them, keep them, keep them. They're so good. They, they even give something like resistance, I think. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I've seen um, that we had a lot of new foods, but I hadn't hadn't looked at how to make any of them yet. Yeah, I've been uh, cooking a lot. I feel like I, I'm in real life. I love to cook. <laughs> don't ask Maya. He thinks my cooking sucks. <laughs> He's never tried your bacon sandwich. 
Exactly. <laughs> so, shall we show everybody? Yeah, I think it's time. Imagine. <laughs> <laughs> so, our idea is to make like a pond. Like, how do you call those boats? Where you can put cars uh, on and stuff? A ferry. A ferry, yeah, yeah, yeah. A ferry. So, so, what if we make a ferry, a parking lot, and an entrance? I like it. I mean, the parking we just lot is right the, there. Yeah, on that island. Yes. Because we can do a lot here, and I think we can somehow find a, a way to get people over to that side, maybe. But I think this island is big enough. I think so too. And we can just and, remove uh, the flowers, right? Yeah, yeah. We'll leave some of them, obviously, for some nice decoration, but we've got a clear room for the exhibits. Exactly. Also, I have a, I opened up my, my world map here. Oh, to yeah, To get yeah. an idea of the, the land that we have. So this Ooh. whole area that I'm highlighting on my screen here, this is where we plan to put the zoo. And we're not really sure how big it's going to be at this point. We've got a lot of new animals that we're working with. But this is going to be the entrance right here. And then all the land behind it and around it will be for the for the other exhibits. And I know our boss loves parking lots. Yeah. Oh, he loves parking lots. Exactly. Is that just a random pick on our balcony? Well, it's the one you were riding before. It's got the saddle. Wait, how did it? I don't know. I have no idea how it got there. Um. Oh, also, yeah, I th <laughs> forgot that was there. <laughs> <laughs> Good that I was recording because... <laughs> I was like, you know what? We let's, need an enchanting table. Yeah, let's so put it right up. Oh, oh my god. Quick. Oh, it must have jumped. I didn't... Oops. I didn't like this? I could jump over trapdoors for some reason. Hmm. But, I mean, well, I we got it. would have got there. We got a balcony pick now. Yep. But that's not what we're here for. <laughs> Are you looking at me waiting for I you to I answer? I zoomed in as soon as you said that. <laughs> I did the same. <laughs> <laughs> we want a roof. And we asked you we in the roof. we asked you guys in the last episode what kind of roof. And we got a comment. It said black and brown roof would look great. And I think that's true. What do you I think? think? So too. We have that. I think we already have a. We've already got black doors made out of ebony wood, and so that'd be a nice accent to go on top, and then some some brown as well with either the the dark oak or spruce could tie it in very nice. Shall we uh, pump that out right now? I think so. You can see almost average again in its natural habitat. He just made a roof, the inside of the upper floor. I think he noticing us again. Oh no! <laughs> we did it! I think. I think. <clears throat> I don't know. <laughs> so we did something on the upper floor which I love. We gave it a glass roof for natural lighting, but I don't like the textures of the glass too much. But it, inside, it looks amazing. 
<laughs> I think the the outside of the glass textures is definitely iffy, but I think the the, the <laughs> I think it looks good enough on the inside that that we can keep it. Yeah, 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 exactly. Geek has uh, gone ahead, found some very interesting blocks on the carpenter table, and made this amazing interior wall for us. I think you can uh, see these, hmm. this skylight here as well. Wait. There we go. Perfect. It kind of has an African feel to it. It does. It does. Really cool. So a lot of natural lighting, which I love. We can I make... believe we're going to be putting storage in here, right? Yes. Yes. So yeah. Yeah, I think we did great. I think it looks pretty good. And like I said, the, the roof in here looks great, but from the outside, it's a bit iffy. Yeah. Iffy on the outside. Inside, though, does look great. It's like an Oreo. The inside is good, <laughs> but the outside is... Ugh. I don't know. I like I like both parts of the Oreo. I think we need to figure out what to do next, because we need to come up with a design for the entrance, right? Yes. But what will that be? Thinking we should include that copper for sure. Oh yeah, we got a lot of copper. As, either as pillars or as lettering. Also, I turned my shaders on and the inside of this thing looks so cool the way the light comes in. Whoa, I just turned my shaders on. I don't know if this record records well, but... Woo-wee! Oh, wow. With the glass texture, the uh, shadow. Yeah. Looks really cool. That's so cool. I love it. Back to normal Minecraft. Uh, bloop. There we go. Oh, you look so much better in shaders, man. Hey, uh... <laughs> <laughs> Do you need something like for a farm that I can build? or Because I'm not a redstone, and you know me. I do, actually. Do you see the sign over here? <laughs> Was it there already? It has been here. No. 100% <laughs> check the footage. <laughs> hey, Geek Squeak. Any chance you can make this barn better? Oh my god. I didn't see that. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I think I can do that. I can texture it a little bit. I can think I, I can work have, with this. I have an idea for the downstairs. I'll handle this area down here because I've got a, an interesting idea for it. I just don't mm -hmm. have the uh, the research resources to do it yet. Did that sheep? <laughs> he just walked over there to share himself. Walked in and did it itself. <laughs> that is nice. <laughs> That's hilarious. He's looking at you. Don't you don't even need to trap these guys. They no, just walk automatically. <laughs> Re-roaming sheep farm. So we'll do that, and then later we'll work on the entrance because I have no the idea entrance. what it's gonna look like. Yep. Okay, uh, high five. High five? Did I high five you? No. I'm just not gonna, why can <laughs> I never high five somebody? So, I was exploring a bit to uh, gather some resources and I was doing this off screen, but I had to record this because I found a giant ship on the land. I never seen this before. This is like rare or this is normal, so let's check it out and see what we can find. Okay, and uh, we got a ring. Poison resistance, very nice. Okay. Um, there must be more, right? We got some suspicious too. More moss. I think it's spring... Oh, it's just onions. I thought they look like spring onions. The poison resistance ring is pretty cool, but this... It's also pretty cool. We got an empty map again. I got another one, um, let's see, here, right here, empty map, really cool. So yeah, I found this in this really cool barley filled land, because I'm looking for a mesa, which is pretty hard to find. I mean, I've explored so much already, but this is so cool, I've never seen this before. Let me guys know if, if this is normal. <laughs>
So now we have everything for this barn. Hopefully it's enough. And we're going to change it up a little bit. Hey. Hey. So I'm done with the barn, but don't look yet. I have a few things. Oh, oh, I showed it a little bit because my viewers also didn't see it yet. Ooh. So I figured something out, but first I want to show you something. All right. All right. Oh, come follow me. Go stand here and read the signs out loud one by one. You need an axe to... Uh... Oh, you have one? one? Okay, cool, cool, cool. Am I supposed to break these? Yep, yep, yep. And read them out okay. loud. As first, how are you doing? So I have a question. Hey, man. I know it's a lot to ask. But I have ADHD and I'm not good at sorting. What about an amazing, almost average sorting system? Ah. Huh? I mean, that would be cool, right? You're so good at redstone, and I'm not. I bet you'll do it in 10 minutes. That's how good you are. We just have so many <laughs> items. Thanks. <laughs> I can definitely work on one of those. I you don't do it know in? if we actually have the, uh, the resources for one yet, but I'll go about figuring out what we need exactly. We can get the resources, but can you do it in 10 minutes is the question. Probably not in 10 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> so... Here it is. <laughs> you look behind you. I hey, uh, changed it up a wow. little bit. <laughs> that looks a thousand times better. You like it? I do. This looks awesome. Got some wool in it. Got some sheeps. Ooh, little mini blocks even. <laughs> yeah, I didn't even know how to, what to put in there. It's just shelves. You can put stuff on it. A oh, coffee yeah. maker? Yeah. We can make <laughs> juices. It's a juicer. Oh, if you put a, I didn't if, realize you could actually use it. Yeah, if you put a carrot in it, you can get carrot juice and stuff. If you look in this chest, I made some tomato juice. Ooh. Tomato juice, coffee, glowberry tea. Cool, right? Yeah, that's pretty cool. So you happy with it? I am. This looks awesome. Awesome, thanks. So, oh, I see. I uh, forgot to change something up on the other side. <laughs> There's still some spruce here. I'll uh, change that up later. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, you see all these flowers here, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, That's all with one bone meal. Oh. How's that working? I don't know. The bone meal doesn't get used. Oh. Uh. <laughs> but if you hit a flower, it will. What's happening here? <laughs> I think we have a, a glitch that can work in our favor. I think so. It's a glitch in the matrix. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, and I made a tree. Oh my, my god, how did I not even see that? <laughs> it's not my best tree, but I thought it fitted here. It's a pretty good looking tree, though. Thank you. Which, what, what is this? Uh... If I'm being honest, I can't remember. <laughs> oh! Oh no. Oh my god. <laughs> you were quiet for so long. Um, Why did that work? I didn't think it would work on logs we placed. I didn't think so too. Um, oh no. <laughs> okay, intermission, let's quickly fix this. Well, that happened. Yeah, yeah, it's back. It's brand new now. <laughs> it's it's not the same, but. <laughs> Fresh tree. <laughs> I kind of like the uh, weird dip in it. Yeah, I think it looks cool. Okay, so uh, yeah, that's what I did. Um, yeah. I think we need to uh, start working on an entrance, right? Yeah, I think that's the next plan. <clears throat> Wait a minute. Oh, I forgot. Yeah, I found these Looks and like I took them home. These cows, cows are yellow. <laughs> <laughs> I totally forgot. I brought these home. Awesome. Now we've got some moo blooms. Yeah, we can make an exhibit with them. Yeah. I mean, it's better than boars. How's that, vanilla players? You don't have moo blooms. No, <laughs> we have moo blooms. <laughs> <laughs> Hey. Hey. Oh. <laughs> so, um, 
Do we count to three? Let's count to three, yeah. One. Two. Four. Five. Three? Uh, uh. <laughs> look at that. We have an almost finished entrance. It is most of the way done. Still needs some signage, some some decor, some yeah, walls. You're so much better with the banners than I am. Yeah, those uh I think those are looking pretty good so far. I love it, man. I think we did a great job. Yep. Just like, have uh what, five more letters to do and then the sign's all complete, and then we can actually put some exhibits back here. Yeah, but we, we still need to do something really big, and it's going to cost us a lot of time. And I think we should do it now. You don't really have a good shuffle, right? I do not. I have 24 I levels. Maybe I can enchant it for you. I have 25. Well, go do it. Yeah. <laughs> Six hours later. Average? Oh, there he is. <laughs> Eight. Right when it's it. That's crazy. You're like a jet fighter, but in the water. Fastest swimmer in the West. They call you torpedo for nothing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now, so. Uh, I've got gonna, an efficiency to shovel. Shall we uh, remove this hill? Let's go for it. Sandwich. I should eat a sandwich. I got sandwiches. Oh, nice. <laughs> so, oh, oh, somebody's ready for his new exhibit. He's already trying to get in the exhibit. <laughs> it hasn't even been built yet. So we're done, I think, with removing the dirt and grass that we wanted to remove, right? Mm-hmm. And maybe you can explain what we're going to do. So, uh, we've got the entrance built up and now it's the perfect time to start putting some exhibits inside of here. So, up here I've got somewhat of a layout done. This is not going to be the full full thing, it's going to be a bit bigger. It's a quarter circle but inside now. here, this is going to be the butterfly exhibit. And I think Geek has already gone about capturing some butterflies in some jars, so we'll have some to release already. I think we have three. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. A full exhibit. People will love it. Um, you want to say what you're doing over there? Yeah, so I made an outer line. Uh, I'm going to dig down a little bit. Uh, There's going to be a glass wall and stuff like that, so people can look through. And it will be the boar exhibit. And we've already got our first boar lined up and waiting to, to jump inside of it. Hey guys, is my home ready yet? It is, uh, it'll be ready next episode. <laughs> oh, I have to wait. Thank you everybody so much for watching. Uh, if you didn't like the video yet, what did we say? You'll be much appreciated. Yeah. And if you're new click and not like subscribed button. yet, oh, click that like button. And if you're new and not subscribed yet, Press that red button. Uh oh. Oh, oh no. Okay, this is the end of the episode. Everybody, thank you so much. Bye bye.